You need to trick. I'm taking Alexander's tinderbox. Yes, Prince, Prince Alexander. I'm a pushover. Alexander. All right, we're back. Flare out. Uh, we'll never explain it. Uh, okay, uh, flute, I think, for wallflower? Yeah. May I have this dance? I love this game. We're the king of dance. We're the king of pop. Billy Jean is not my <laughs> lover. I just love that the snapdragons are snapping with the song. I don't know who's playing the guitar, though. The babies. Alexander stops playing the flute, but the wallflowers and snapdragons continue to dance, caught up in the music and oblivious to everything around them. And we use the opportunity to kidnap again. While the wallflowers dance, Alexander snatches the hole in the wall. Yeah! Man, we're a great kidnapper. That was a, f a Snatcher is a fun napper. game. Oh, Jesus. Ah, ah, no, it's wrong. Wait, grab one of those. Alexander takes a bottle of milk from the milkweed bush. Mm. Yeah, we... <laughs> Jesus. Of course. Apparently, the dogwood tree doesn't like Alexander standing that close. To the milkmen. Right, we actually don't need that in for a really long time, I don't think. Uh, but eh, we have it. Okay, um... Okay, let me just think. What we have here, do we have everything for the greatest challenge of the game? We, I think we do. We need to make another trade. The magic. No, uh, grab, Alexander. grab, yes, there. Okay, we need to trade. No, Isle of Wonder, we're on the Isle of Wonder. Ah, oh, God damn it. Alexander Alex feels a pulling sensation. Pulling out his map, that is. Alexander. Okay. We need to go trade in the flute again. We need to trade for the tinder box. And then we're going to do the most harrowing part of the game. MLFF31. What DTF? the fuck are you Hello. referencing? <laughs> Just a lot of, like single letter or even no. uh, acronymistic uh, phrasings used by those on Tinder. Oh, Tinder. Okay. I have no idea where you were going with the that. Shop is okay. Uh, yeah, we, we already have the flute here. Would you mind? Take it. Of course. All right. Uh, tinder box. I believe I'll take the Tinder box. Very good, Prince Alex. Enjoy your Tinder box well, you said that and bring really it back rude. anytime. Thank you. All right, we're out of here. The way Alexander said that just sounds so rude. He's like, I'll take the Tinder box. I took the Tinder box. <laughs> I'll of course. take the Tinder box. He punches him, takes it all. <laughs> <laughs> you will give me that. I'm going to take that. Yeah, give me my you fucking don't understand, copper Prince point. Alex. You need to trick. I'm taking Alexander's tender box. Yes, Prince, Prince Alexander. I'm a pushover. <laughs> That's what Alexander. they're there for. <laughs> it's there for you to steal from me. I don't know what money even is. Oh, fuck. I'm at the word a wall. rock. We're at the word wall. What now? Shout out, we're going to learn next. <laughs> yeah, we're going to learn next. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, everybody. So as this playthrough started, I sent a, a .rar file to What You Can Brandon called Super then. Secret File. And I told them, you don't open that until I tell you to open that. Well, guess what aisle this is? This is the aisle. Oh, I, I, there we go. Aisle. Of copy protection. <laughs> this, all, all the solutions to this puzzle are only in the manual. And you can open your super secret files now, guys. It's Christmas oh, come you. early. 
Yay. Super Secret File, also fuck Brandon. <laughs> yep, it's called Super Secret File, also fuck Brandon. You yeah. get to open it. It's the guide or the manual to King's Quest 4 through 6. Skip to the 6th section. <laughs> there appears to be something etched into the face of the cliff. Alexander decides to get closer. Ignorance kills, wisdom elevates. So this is the first puzzle, everybody. Um, now, the answer to this, I believe, is in the manual, but I remember it off the top of my head, so I'm going to just do it. But for context, for anybody who doesn't know what I mean by copy protection, a lot of these old PC games had puzzles where the answer to it was only in the game manual. The, and the idea was it was really easy to copy a floppy disk of this game to give to people illegally, but it was much harder to print out manuals. And so people who illegally got the game likely wouldn't have the manual and thus wouldn't be able to beat the game. It's to incentivize actually buying it from the publisher. Uh, now, so that you don't need to look through the travel guide of the Isle, the, the, the Green Isles, the Land of the Green Isles, which I believe is actually, the, if I remember right, the manual is written as if it's a travel guide for the Isle, or for the Land of the Green Isles, which is great. Um, it has answers to a bunch of puzzles on this island that we're going to need. I remember that the answer to Endurance Kills Wisdom uh, Elevates is we press the letters rise in order. So R, I, S, I guess the first E. Huge blocks of stone erupt from the granite cliffs. There we go. Okay, we get it. Gotta see it all. Alexander stares with wonder. That's quite a way to welcome a guest, if indeed it is a welcome. All right, it's time for Copy Protection Mountain. Okay, now for the dumbest puzzle. The steps cannot be moved any further no, back. I, I, I want to stand on. I just need to carefully click on each one or I fall and die. Why? Now, this was much harder. I don't know. This was much harder back in the day when screens were tiny and mouses were in inaccurate. But uh, it's not that bad now. Just, you know, don't rush it. We're good. Oh, it's auto, auto going to the next one. Okay. Eh. All right, we got a puzzle coming up. I'm going to need you guys help. We got to read it, and that should give us a clue to where in the manual it is. Okay. Alexander examines the strange etchings in the face of the cliff. A master of language will four-letter word. Now, as far as I know, this is an alphabet. And I'm assuming the answer is rise. I need <laughs> you guys to find where it's got the alphabet of the language of the winged people. I believe that's who lives here. And you need to figure out how to spell rise and describe it to me with these stupid symbols or we fall to our death. Okay. Uh, R is has a black square at the bottom left and an open square at the top right and it has a little uh it has a line going from top to bottom uh top sorry top left to bottom right Ooh, where it moves it, right moves it, down moves right moves down is it this no no, no. it's sorry. the one okay it's closest to his feet oh this one oh black box okay i see what you mean okay okay that's r uh, what's, what's I? I is, uh, looks like a cup with a boomerang in it. Cup with a, this one? No, uh, no, no um. In the middle, with, uh, middle column. Oh, this? Right there. Oh, yes. it's like a, it's like a Tetris thing and the Tetris blocks falling yeah, like down in it. Yeah, like Yeah, okay, I gotcha. Okay, uh, so we need S. S is, uh. Looks kind of like a little T-Rex. Like a little T-Rex. I can see this that, one? but not really. No, um, this uh, I'm looking for it right now. No, uh, it's like a little T-Rex. What here? Brand is... is not describing it very well. Oh, <laughs> it looks like a little T-Rex. It... Yeah, to him. Oh, there it is. Um, go to the far left square and move to right. 
This? What? That one. That, yep. that, oh, that yeah, I like guess. A, that looks like a T-Rex? A little bit. Uh, on, on our man manual, it's a little uh, condensed. Yeah, okay, so I was going to say, the, the manual's really low res, in fairness. Okay, yeah. and we need E. E looks like a little shoe. Um, oh, that this one? Would be, yes, yep. that one. Did I? That should be Nothing it. Happens. Fuck, is it not the word rise? Hmm. Alexander. Is this the um, second puzzle or the third? A, a master, master of, language, of will. language will what? What is the answer to that? I don't know. Talk? Read? A master Read of language will... Hmm. Because I was Hang thinking on. it would be rise because A, it's the answer to the previous one. And also, a uh, master of language will rise. Oh, a master of language will soar. I found it. It's in oh. the uh, it's in the lore of the ancient ones, which is just slightly higher up in the. Uh, okay. In the okay. See, it's that's it, that's why that tri travel guide is so important. Okay. So soar. So S was a dinosaur uh, S, that we pointed S out earlier. The, S was that, which is no, somehow a dinosaur. Yep. Okay. O is o? the is the, uh, the the one immediately to its right. Yeah, the, the face? mother face. Okay. A looks like a football field or a foosball field on this the, one? in the manual. This um, one? No, it's to to the right of that one. This yeah. one. Yep. Oh, I see that. Okay. And then R was R, R the was this? first one. Yep. By that my one. feet. Yeah. The stone beneath Alexander's feet trembles as more steps emerge from the granite cliffs. Yay! The okay. stone beneath his feet trembles as the stair goes back into the wall. As he gets pulled he feels by the... Pulling. Feels, a, feels the pulling of the undertow. Not the undertow. <laughs> uh, we're still on copyright ma uh, mountain two. Because I think there's more puzzles along here. You guys aren't going to be closing that manual for a while. Probably a couple episodes. This whole mountain is full of puzzles in the manual. Ooh. I like the sound effects. The boo boo, boo boo. I love it. Boo boo. boo, boo. It's boo, still boo. going. And again, if I misclick once, uh, I fly off and careen to my death. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Alexander examines the strange etchings in the face of the cliff. Okay. So, okay. So the riddle that is said in this uh, in the manual says four men standing in a row. So hit number four. I imagine. Okay. Third from the left and down you go. Okay. So don't hit three. Uh, the no, rest third. in order move you on. The youngest, the oldest, and the second son. Uh, the stone beneath hey! Alexander's feet trembles as more steps emerge so from the granite So four, cliffs. one, two. Got it. And if you hit three, you die. Okay, that wasn't bad. I like riddles. Which, I guess, is why I probably like King's Quest games so much. They really like riddles. Oh, wait, that's what it is. Four men standing in a row, third from the left and down you go. So if you hit the third one and yeah. you, you go down. Yeah. But the rest in order move you on. The youngest is the one on the right. The oldest is the one on the left. And the second son is the one immediately to the left, to the right of the first one. Yeah, so I got most of the puzzle and lucked into the rest. It's still going. Oh, man. We're almost up. We can do it. Oh. Alexander examines the strange etchings in the face of the cliff. Sacred, sacred four. four. Okay, so I think there are like, there's like a sacred word or a sacred four symbols or something that you're going to read about the winged people. The ancient ones. So you're looking for the word sacred four. You could probably control F it. Control. Probably fucking. not, because uh, th this is a picture, not necessarily. Right, a, it's uh, right. It's a PDF, but it's of pictures, not of text. The lowest being from every. Oh, hang on. Meaning to every creature, the sacred four, the emotion tranquility, the color azure, the creature caterpillar, and the element air. Emotion tranquility is is D, which looks like a rook. 
Uh, oh, I got you. Yeah, got that. Uh, the color azure. O. It's O. But yeah, it's the. No, that's face. color turk. Oh, sorry. No, you're right. It is O. It's the that's worried like, face. The worried face. Okay, no. got it. Yeah. The creature caterpillar. Uh, Q. Yeah. Is that this one? Because it looks like it could that be is a that caterpillar. One. Okay, sweet. Yep. And the element air, which I saw earlier, that was G, which is one? no this. No, sorry. Mm. Uh, G has this really long, solid line, it looks like. It goes from bottom left, it goes up to the right slightly, and in the middle it goes down again to the right mm. and then up again. And then there's a dot. This one? Yes. Yep. Okay. The stone beneath Alexander's nice. feet trembles as more steps emerge from the granite cliffs. I think that's the last one of the word puzzles. There is a fifth challenge, it says. Ooh, okay. King Rock! Funny to meet you here. <laughs> oh man. I can't even imagine doing this with a bad mouse on a tiny monitor. Because you gotta really nail it. Like, you will fall to your death. Okay, we're good, we're good. Alright, it's still going. Okay. Come on. What's this last one? Alexander examines the strange etchings in the face of the cliff. Uh, all silent cry, the noble boulders. What? Only those of the highest order may ascend the cliffs of logic. <laughs> I forgot they're called the fucking cliffs of logic. Uh, all silent cry, the noble boulders. Only those of the highest order can ascend the cliffs of logic. Okay, so I need to spell something by clicking the letters in this in order because it's clearly like the puzzle on the floor where I had to spell rise. All silent cry, the noble boulders. What the fuck does that mean? Hold on, I'll save real Nothing quick. Nothing happened. Yeah, I didn't click anything. I think you have to count the letters. Oop. And how many how many of the letters there are? Uh you like in each individual word or just grand total? Grand total, I think. Because you two, got three, four, four, four L's. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight. But I don't know why that number would help us. I'm saying like you have four L's in total. You have four E's. OK. Um, why do we want to know the number of E's and L's, though? That's what I'm thinking is that they are the most common letters, it looks like. Oh, well, like with the previous one of these puzzles, it was literally like I just like clicked the word rise and that would do it. Nothing happened. Alexander. Only they those of the highest order. Is that maybe a hint to something else in the in the lore? I I don't know, because highest order, if, if that's what it says in the manual there. That makes me think, you know, noble. But all silent cry the noble boulders. What the fuck does that mean? All silent. I almost feel like I'm reading it wrong, but this is the this is the letters, right? That that is the word cry. Mm-hmm. Yep. That is cry. Yeah, it's not like a stylistic G or something. Not that that would help. Hmm. What are the noble boulders? Does it say anything about that? Maybe a noble boulder is their word for something. Unless I just spell rise again. Um. You can't. Right, rise. Nope. Nope. Nothing. Alex. Uh, how about soar? Can I do soar? Uh, first letter. Then, no, it's Nothing. not soar. Alex. Huh. How many letters am I allowed to do? Try ascend. Oh, ascend. Okay. A S C E N D. 
ASC the stone beneath Hey, you got it. Where did you find that? Yeah, it was just in all caps. That's what cliffs. I figured. Okay. 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 So I think this is the last one before we're at the top of the mountain. There is one more thing we need the guide for. Although I, I think we can do that right away, actually. It's the catacombs. Yeah. Uh, the catacombs, you, sh you guys should have a map that vaguely marks off where treasure and where instant death is. And it's not required to do the catacombs, but it greatly helps. I don't know if this is much of a map. It is it is a map. It's just incredibly hard to read. It'll make more sense once we're in there. Okay. Alexander finds himself finally at the top of the cliffs. Exhausted, he steps over the lip of the plateau and stands. What? Fucking genie. You make such an yep. effort to climb the cliffs, young man. The winged ones who live on this island have the power of flight. You could have it too, if you'd only eat a berry from this magical flying nightshade bush. Why would he tell us it's a nightshade See? bush? The sweet berries will make you float like a petal on the wind. <laughs> Try some. Yeah, nightshade uh, is poisonous. I'm just going to do a mountain top. Did I spell that wrong? That you looks wrong. It. Really? You got it. Okay, yep. <laughs> it looks wrong. <laughs> Let's eat. All right. I'll try some of your berries. Don't be a creep, Alexander. Oh, goody. Eat quickly, dear boy, and I'll show you the way to the lord and lady of this isle. By which what? I mean, you'll die. <laughs> <laughs> Slightly bitter, pretty one. Now, oh, Alexander yearned that one. Tickets. Oh. Next. And then there's some land I have for sale in the death bogs of Tamir. I, I don't think I, I don't even get it. get it. All right, uh, right. We don't want to do that. What's this say? Alexander is standing at the top of tall cliffs. To the north is the peak of a mountain rising to meet the clouds. To the left is an ominous set of bolted doors. An old woman is standing nearby. She peers at Alexander with friendly interest. And evil eyes. No, this. Alexander is an no? old okay. woman. Comes. Huge doors are... All right, I guess I can't actually see it, but the guide, I think, says that the over top of the door, it says something. All right, we're going. Young man, you offend me. I try to help you, and you insist on being rude. Yeah, fuck you. Uh, and then it stares yeah. into the camera. Oh, oh okay. Friend, stay tied to the ground like a load of lead. See if I care. You, 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 human. A racist. How odd. Oof. The old woman just disappeared in a cloud of smoke. Perhaps those berries are even more powerful than Fuck she led off. Alexander to believe. Narrator's trying to get us killed. Look, an intruder. Hey, Hail Caesar! How did you get up here, human? <laughs> I climbed the cliffs. That is not possible. No one has solved the cliffs of logic in several centuries. And if the cliffs were to be solved, it would certainly not be by a human. I I didn't mean to trespass. I only wanted to visit this beautiful island. No visitors have been welcome on the Isle of the Sacred Mountain in years. Not since the Red and White Queens had spies in the guise of friendly visitors steal our island's sacred golden fleece. But we will not display such foolish trust again. You will have to answer to Lord Azure and Lady Ariel. They will determine what will be done with you. I can assure you, it will not be- Let pleasant. me go, I'm a king! I'm a king! <laughs> Well, time to get impaled. Uh, oh, there we I thought it froze. <laughs> With what trickery did you master the Cliffs of Logic and reach the city of the Winged Ones? Copyright Only the magic uh, nothing, of Koopa. Could you, like, cross your legs or something? I meant no harm. <laughs> it's a little awkward. The Cliffs of Logic. King Cocula. It is the sacred oracle's <laughs> prophecy, Azure. Yes, Ariel. Hmm. It is lucky for you, human, that climbing the Cliffs of Logic is part of a prophecy that I cannot ignore. K 
King Campbell. We have just been ordered by Wazir al Hazred himself to dispose of any strangers that might land on our fair isle. But the prophecy would have a different fate befall you. The prophecy predicts that whosoever climbs the cliffs of logic will defeat the Minotaur. The Minotaur has violated our sacred catacombs and eats our young in sacrifice. Our own daughter, Lady Celeste, was taken there only this morning as his most recently demanded offering. A dilemma, then. Whom shall I obey in regards to your fate, the Oracle or the Crown? But since al Hazred did not dictate how I was to dispose of intruders, and since you cannot possibly survive the catacombs, your imprisonment there should serve both purposes quite admirably. I will not resist you in this, my lord. I shall do my best to save your daughter. Hmm. First, I must tell you that the catacombs are a labyrinth of rooms, a place of exceeding danger. You will need many tools and clear wits to survive it. Well, that's good. I am a tool. I am ready. Very well. My guards will take you there now. You seem courageous enough, but the catacombs will determine how brave you really are. All right. It's time for our greatest test yet. Once once they fly us over, I don't don't feel like they needed to show us this. Uh, oh, that was fast crash landing. Why did you tell Lord Azure you were ready and willing to face the catacombs? No one is ever ready, and only a fool could be willing. And you are far wiser, I suppose, to leave a maiden to die? To not fight this plague on your own people? Bravery and suicide are two different things, human. You will have a chance to renounce your choice soon enough, when you lay trembling under the Minotaur's hooves. We shall see. Thanks for the escort. We only escort you to your death. May the fates make it quick so that you do not have to scream long. All right. Well, it was dark. Yeah. So if we didn't have the, the items we needed... The catacomb's entrance door is locked from the outside by the winged one's guards. It seems that leaving the catacombs by that door is not an option. So, if we didn't have the right items here, then they would say, like, go get prepared, like, leave the mountain, go get prepared, next time we see you, we're throwing you in the catacombs. So, we do have all the items we need to solve this. On the next episode, we conquer the catacombs, and let's make sure to get all the items we need here, because it's a real bitch if you need to go back in here to get items after you leave. Until next time, have a nice day. See ya. I did it with my left hand this time and it didn't work.